going on YouTube? Grumpy Skunk here with another mystery box. This is Gasha Robot. This was their recent lime vending machine mystery box. $29.99. Uh, I only bought one. So let's kind of smashed at the bottom. So let's see what we got. I don't remember offhand what they listed as some of the grails. Um, so there we have Gosh a Robot. Different color sticker than the last one. Alright, let's see what we got. Doesn't feel like it's in a protector. Well, we got Freddy Funko. This is the Freddy Funko 2000 piece purple and teal um, robot from this past year's um, San Diego Comic Con, uh, the Funko Fun Days event. Now, Normally, you know, I'd be thrilled with this. This is, uh, it's a good pop. Um, and for those of you that know me, my main collection is Freddy Funko. Um, you can see a couple of them behind me. Um, what you can't really see is that that goes up to another full shelf above it. And there are probably about... 50 or so up there. Uh, I will do a video of Freddy Funko one of these days. I just need to clean things up a little bit because this office is still really disgusting. So, there's the pop. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with him. Um, I may keep it as a duplicate. I may take it out of the box. I may trade it or sell it. I'm not really sure. Um, you know, anything else normal that's a duplicate, I would just immediately get rid of it. But, um, you know, collecting these and, and being part of um, Freddy Funko groups and things like that, it may be something that I hold on to, um, you know, to help other... Um, Freddy collectors down the line. I've had a couple of people really help me out um, to, you know, grow my collection and uh, find some of the, the harder to find pieces that I needed. Um, and they, you know, were awesome about everything. Um, you know, their, their prices were like unbeatable um, simply because you know, they all know what it's like to collect Freddy Funko. And it's an awesome thing to collect for me. I love it. Um, but it's also extremely frustrating because you will never be a completionist. You, <laughs> the majority of the high-end pieces where they only made a couple of them, uh, the prices are just astronomical you know, nothing that 98% of people will ever be willing to pay. So, um, you know, some of, some of those pieces just get really tough. So you see things and, you know, you absolutely want to have them when you, you know, collect that. And, uh, just, you know, so many of them are out of reach. So, um, I'll, I'll have to think on what I want to do with this. Uh, but, you know, I'm happy with it. I don't remember. I've, I've had it for a while, so I'm not really sure. Um, it's probably right around what the um, what the box costs. It's, it's probably around 30 bucks. Um, it might be slightly higher. It might be slightly lower. A lot of the, the Freddy from, from Fun Days have, um, you know, bounced around quite a bit. And uh, some of them have really dropped and others have 
surprisingly gone up. Um, so it really depends. I appreciate everybody listening to me ramble. Um, if I start talking about Freddy Funko and that, it just it goes on forever. I totally lose track of time. And um, so yeah, sorry. So thank you for watching. I appreciate it. I hope everybody has a great weekend. I will see everybody soon. Be kind to one another. Take care.